Allah is with those who fear Allah. He says, Taqwa is to fear Allah but also to be pious towards Allah because Allah orders goodness and prohibits evil. And when you do that, you would be fearing Allah and being pious towards Allah. Otherwise, on the contrary, you would be obeying your ego, your nafs. And at that time, you would not be fearing Allah. They say the, that the one who doesn't fear Allah is not cha- ashamed of people, of servants of Allah. So f- fearing Allah is is goodness and obeying is goodness and leaving it is evil and vice. And what is needed for humankind is this important thing. Because now shaitan is doesn't want it. He tells everybody to be afraid of everybody else, but not to be afraid of Allah. Yet Allah Almighty is the Malik al Muk, the owner of everything. He is the one who provides everything. We need to ask Him. And wish from him. Otherwise, nobody will be able to help you if Allah doesn't want to help you. Inshallah, these people will come to their senses. But humankind, obeys when it obeys its ego. The ego. The thing that it doesn't want most is taqwa, piety. It doesn't let you do any good. It just wants you to do evil and nothing else. So if you obey your ego, it will it won't leave you alone you can think that you might feed it and it will let go but it won't it will always want more you need to train it so it will be useful for you otherwise it will just be harmful for you it won't give you any goodness but give you harm Allah It'll harm you. May Allah make us amongst those who have taqwa, amongst those who are on his path. May we be always in fear of him, inshallah. May Allah strengthen our faith and iman. And that's when everything will be beautiful, inshallah.